I was meant to do the intro to this video while I was at the pub. Tomorrow, you guys all know Bullfrog. This trip's gonna be so good that I'm gonna have to split it up into a three part series. So, welcome to part one. G'day. You beauty. So, day one's going to be predominantly taken up by the drive down there. It is a thousand kilometres from where I live in Darwin down to King Ash Bay Fishing Club located on the Gulf of Carpentaria. Well, that's enough talking for now. I'll see you again in about eight or nine hours. That's 980 kilometers done and dusted. Just 20 kilometers to go now. The last 20 k's is a dirt road. They've had some patchy rain over the last week, but I don't think we'll have any dramas getting in. absolutely nothing's changed which is pretty cool so I did track down Ash he was having a quiet afternoon beverage with Steve from NT Luxury Houseboats that's when young Damon walked in <laughs> how you doing mate? Mr. Mikey Edward Elizabeth the third. Say, <laughs> <laughs> he hit another rock bar with Brett's boat again so there were some gearbox repairs that needed doing welcome to Backyard Mechanics King Ash Bay 101 <laughs> <laughs> they most Another motor. Oh. <laughs> hit your head, yet another rock bar. <laughs> what Damon is holding here is actually two parts. The two parts had fused together and needed to come apart. <laughs> this is young Seth, Steve's son. Get a haircut. What's, what's your um? What's your fridge look like? Do you want a northern? Yeah. Yeah, come get one. Uh, do you want some up and goes, mate? Uh, look, I'll just up and leave that one for a minute. Cool, because I didn't bring any food. I'm literally living off beer and up and go. That's all right. There you go. You got that one? Yeah, yeah. Better. Cheers, mate. Yeah, so this part is from Brett's outboard. Brett, you've seen in my videos before. So it turns out the current plan is to head out to Weeby Fishing Lodge for a couple of nights. And we need to get Brett's outboard working to take a couple of the boys out there. So that's what's happening in here. Side topic, this is actually my two-wheeler. Doesn't look pretty at the moment, but man, I've had some fun on this thing. Are you gonna get this motorbike working for me? I'm um, not so sure, but Dad wants <laughs> Bullfrog to get the carby off somewhere around. Bullfrog needs to get the carby off? Yeah, but he's not so sure. All right, we're waiting for Bullfrog. But back to the parts that need to be separated. After a few beers, a plan was devised to superheat one part and super cool the other, and the inner part would simply fall out. What could possibly go wrong? Hello! <laughs> the mission. 
the Crownus Awheelus. So what's the actual go here, mate? That's from a, a Yami. No, Honda. this is a Honda. Honda. Yeah, one of them really f***ed up boards. Ice cold. <laughs> no movement whatsoever. We needed to escalate things with power tools. Thank God we all had our PPE on. The thongs, mate, unscathed. Sunny's unscathed. That's it. Yep, that's the Widowmaker, a nine inch grinder. goes off like a bomb. After another hour, the job was done. Well, the first half anyway. Nah, it looks alright. So what's your thoughts? Are you going to get bread on the water or what? Look, there could be a 225 horsepower Honda on the water tomorrow. Oh, beauty. We headed down to the bar at King Ash Bay Fishing Club to do a bit of planning for our trip. But the big question was, what's the verdict on Brett's outboard? So what's the verdict on Brett's outboard? Oh, look. We, we've struggled. We've uh, we, we battled with a nine inch angle grinder on it, oh. a welder, LPG gas. The big hammer. Oh look, we, we, we've tried everything and we got it off and we've succeeded. Yeah, we may be low achievers, but we come through in the end. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> At this stage, the plan was for Brett to head out early in his other boat, Thunderbird 6. Young Damon was going to frantically get the outboard back together in the morning and head out in Weeby 1. Then Ash and I are going to wait for Bullfrog and the girls and head out in his boat five o'clock somewhere or Foss. <laughs> yeah, rodeo, right my shout. <laughs> Again? Again! You could say it's a bit of a staggered start. So if you want to come. Oh, it's a staggered come. start. It's yeah, a staggered yeah, yeah, yeah. start. Nice. Variable depending on how much rum we drink tonight. Yeah. <laughs> are we the last ones at the bar again? Yeah. Uh, again. Some things again. never change. No, we're always the last people at the bar. <laughs> So you wrote a song about it. Support your local, support your local mate. Support your local. Because you know what, what was the lyrics were? Yeah. Uh, when the bar closes, there is no debate. The last one standing will be Ash and Kate. When the bar closes, there is no debate. The last one standing will be Ash and Kate. The fishing is... <laughs> too soon. Oh, Thank you for putting up with us. Not soon enough. Damon, where are we going? We are going to Brett's house. Mm -hmm. Hey Jess, Jess. How you going, Jesse? We've seen you in one of my videos before. I think it was the last time we were out at Weeby Lodge. She has been a busy girl. I will show you a sneak preview of what she's been up to tonight, but I'm gonna have to wait till daylight to show you the full package. You're gonna love it. Come here. There's 10. There's 10. She had. 11, there's 10 there? left. Oh my god, this one is the first born. Yeah, one, one got taken by a snake. Taken by a snake. <laughs> we don't talk about the snake. <laughs> what snake? Mo Mo what's our next? It's a plan, mate. Oh. You look a bit dusted. <laughs> I think it's like 7 a.m., and I haven't slept until 7 a.m. in ages. We've just come down to the bar here to find some reception and uh, try and track down Bullfrog. Meant to be here this morning. We're pretty sure we just saw his car come in here and then he just sent it the other direction. Uh, that's his car there at the boat ramp. Froggy, how's it going, mate? Oh, look at the beard. Good to see ya. Oh, yeah. That beard is going good. Ash cooks up an absolute feast of a breakfast. No bacon here, but big pork porterhouses. Yeah, porterhouse. Hey, Jesse. Hey. How's it going? How's it going, Poochies? Oh my goodness. 
What the hell? Hey Jesse, who's a good girl? What a good mummy. What a good mummy you are. Sunbirds are going on like Virgil. As this logistical puzzle comes together, it's gonna to go return Brett's trailer to his house, then we're going down to Bullfrog's place to swap vehicles. Oh, he's already hooked up, ready to go. Oh, he started, yo beauty. So we need the tray back to help refuel the boat. Beautiful work, Froggy. Left handed Froggy. Yeah, He's good at that. <laughs> Mikey's going up to get us a beer, which is always a bloody bonus. Bloody beautiful. Oh, you bastard. Oh. Alrighty. Nice one, Froggy. So we've got three other boats down here waiting for us. I'm in Weeby One waiting for Damon, the skipper. Um, he has been missing in action for about 40 minutes now. No idea where he is. As a positive, the Honda outboard there, that's the one you saw him working on, on the parts for it. It does seem to be operational. Where the f have you been? Here, there and everywhere. Yeah, rightio. <laughs> it's been a chaotic day, let's make it better. <laughs> you, go. you got any cold cans, like northern cans? What, don't you want one? What are they, Coronas? Yeah. Nah. Yeah. Are there cans? Froggy, are you able to bomb me in some cans? Even if they're even if they're warm? Oh, fuck. Sweet, yeah, I'll get one ice. Sweet. As you can see, last night's plans at the bar have gone completely out the window. We're all leaving at the same time, all late in the afternoon. We'll be lucky if we make it there by sunset. Okay, motor is trimmed up. We have successfully arrived at Waiibi Fishing and Wilderness Lodge. We've got Ash and some of the rest of the crew in uh, five o'clock somewhere. Beautiful sunset occurring behind us. The mighty sea cow, the triumphant return. Hey Poochie, how'd you go? The fourth boat you might see in the convoy here is the sea cow. It's the dentist and his missus we met the night before at the bar. So young Damon and I arrived in Weeby One, one of Brett's boats. Brett's still 15 kilometres back. He was taking a smaller boat out here. It's five o'clock somewhere over here. It's five o'clock everywhere over here. You got any cold beers? It's six. Sucks. Sucks. It sucks. Yeah. Will you have a token Kiwi on the trip? Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> okay. I can burn. Living the dream. This one. Hey Pitchy! Hey Pitchy! How you going? I see Brett coming in the distance, as well as the sunset. So we have officially made it to Waibi Fishing and Wilderness Lodge, and it is certainly very good to be here. Katie, what do you reckon? You beauty! <laughs> What is 
What's going on? Damon, come here. What's going on, Mikey? Here we are at the, uh, the center of the universe. The center of the universe. At the end of part one of this video. So we haven't even done any fishing yet, but it, man, I'm buggered. I, I just want to put this camera down. I've been yeah, carrying around all day. Yeah. We're, we're going to do some fishing, maybe. <laughs> We are going to do some fishing tomorrow. It's going to be an awesome video. I would say stay tuned. I'll upload it in the next, say, four days. Part two will be out in four days from now. Trust me, you'll love it. <laughs> Hope you enjoyed watching this episode. And you'll love it. <laughs>